Where did it go? Boop! I'm not, I'm attempting to not do quick saves as much, but as recent we, what has been recently shown is that every now and then it's like, you know what? I need a quick save. <laughs> I need a load. Hmm. I don't know if there's any point in us trying to sneak around being the group that we are. But also, I have a giant glowy glaive on my back. Yeah, I, there's no point in us stealthing around because I am carrying a light going. source on my back. Ugh. Kairos warning. Seems like Van needed to be reminded that you don't take from the stash. The stash is mine. You get what I give you. I find you taking from the stash. You like Van. Be smart. Don't be like Van. Gris. Mmm. I'm ready. Whatever may come. We're gonna take these paintings. These are obviously stolen, so I'm just gonna take them. As long as we don't overburden Halsen. No time to rest. Swift as my feet can carry me. What a stash. Beware. <laughs> Is trapped. <laughs> oh, dang it. I should have known. I should remember. Is this one bad? That's it? Lame. Whatever was in there got blowed up. Oh well. Can I walk down? Oh, okay. <clears throat> Good thing I didn't have house and look at the chest. I think it would have killed him. Hello? Hello? No? Lovely malty beer. A stun melon. Oh, a sun melon. <laughs> a little boat? Can we go somewhere? Map pointing to a secret beach in the wall of Worms Rock. I, <laughs> I knew it. I knew there would be another way in, and I knew that this was a place to look for it. E it's okay. This was definitely the way uh, uh, my character would do it. It is by doing it the way I did it. Mm -hmm. Uh, secret breach in the wall of Worms Rock Fortress. Cool beans. Um, so that, I think that's the whole point of this. And this doesn't take you anywhere. The whole point is to find out that there is actually a secret way into... Yep, I'm too late. <laughs> I'm too late for this place. But it is good to know that there's... <coughs> multiple <coughs> routes of trying to sneak the absolute into the city and we did stop one of them so that's good and i think it's the absolute who would know then that this maybe i don't know actually know who was here first and whose hideout this was first It seems like the guild was here and then wanted to put a stop to things, like put a stop to the Stone Lord encroaching. Um, and if that's the case, then we've taken care of that. So. Well, it's like, oh, no, not that. Where is it? Interrogate the Tormaker. He's supposed to be at Sharus's caress, but apparently those are... And I think that was over here. So why is that over there? I don't know. Something's on my mind. In a brothel. Listen. 
What? The missus and I have been dreaming about the city. No more sleeping rough. What? Didn't expect to find it locked down tighter than a watcher's fist. So what? Oh, Freyo's flop house is adorned with flower motifs matching the key. It has plenty of space. Wow, I wish I could right. figure that we stuff out myself. And pray none of them has sticky fingers. Instead of getting like stuff where I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> That's a big backpack. Bloody ages we spent what? hiking from Murren. What? And they won't let us in the city proper. Bollocks. We're adventurous. Damn you got an arrow sticking out of your bow. Why won't they let you in? The bridge god chatted some shite about a coronation. Couldn't really make head nor tail. That's so, that's a you problem, honestly. Come to Baldur's Gate, he said. Adventurers get welcomed as heroes, he said. Poxy Drim and his bleeding notions. Drim? Oh, that's you. <laughs> um. I didn't. There was what? Flower. They are adorned with flowery motifs. That's a cat. Hear me out. I just don't know. Hello? Word to the wise. Give that ill mate to Temple a wide berth. Room buggers. Certainly not bringing my trade there again. Are, are you a bard? What's your trade? Let me show you. Oh, you just mean, oh, you mean like actual. Okay. Pleasure doing business. I thought like, I don't know, it looked like she was holding, oh no, that's her hair. It looked like she was like putting something on her back. Like a, like a musical instrument. Please observe the following rules. Folded sheets, no big smiles, no tipping janitorial staff. He gets played plenty. No outside food eaten inside. No marks left on the train, ever. It's a flop house, but it's got some rules to try to keep things nice, as nice as possible for everyone. Frego's flop house. Enter as strangers, leave as friends. No vacancies at this time. Uh-huh. Yes, I hear you. Who is saying freaky things? I will gladly do so. Hey, what? <laughs> Might be somebody upstairs? I don't know. Plans to expand his territory. Blooming hell, you look famished. Did you hear that, the master? I've got some victuals that'll warm you right up. Victuals? Um, sure. Have a skeg at these. A what now? I did just take some some soup, so no thank you. I took it. From, that should do you. I took it from the other shop. Anyway, I think there's somebody upstairs talking about master expanding territory. Blah blah blah. Or somebody hidden in a wall. We should return for the ceremony. Yeah. I yeah. have a time break his... The runaway is still missing after all. Nothing happens until he's found. Oh yeah, they're definitely upstairs. Where is the guy? Like the dwarf? Was it a dwarf? Where did he go? He looks kind of like the owner. There he is. I like, he looks like the owner, maybe? A gnome? Halfling? Sir, good, sir. Give me three days and... Oh, I... Uh, apologies. Thought you were someone else. I know. Uh, greetings, so forth, I am so big and intimidating. Oh, who do you think I was? The landlord, Sir Frego Antuna. A most generous soul, I assure you. Uh-huh. Uh, this is so bad. This is so bad. Um, anyway, I'm gonna bet those are doppelgangers upstairs. 
Looking for a killer, a dwarf dressed in red, just like you. How dare yeah. you? Yeah. Accusing an upstanding citizen like it's me dumb. of being a dwarf. <laughs> a <laughs> That's right. Dwarf? I did say he was a halfling, not a dwarf. <laughs> You're so right. I'm so sorry. I even said it myself out loud, and then I was like, "I." I'm so dumb. That's so. The game is like you racist. You think everybody who shorts. Uh, yeah, that was on me. That was 100 percent on me. I'm here. I won't let anything happen. Oh, hearing the conversations repeat over and over is rough. Hello. Oh, you must be the janitor. Now, what do you reckon, lass? You trust these steel watcher thingamajigs? I do not. I trust them about as far as I can throw them. Aye, I'll second that. It's all right where well, we can get work repairing them, but what happens when they build something else to do that? Ah, uh, it's no good, I tell you. Yeah. Is that Siri? That is... Nothing happens until he's found. Oh, 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 they're vampires, but that's Siri from The Witcher. Vampire sp Hold on, hold on. That's I was supposed to look at the flop houses. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. They're talking about, they're talking about, um... I'm not Calcifer. <laughs> what is his name? Asterian's thing. That's right, if I am walking around, I should be bringing a Starian with me. We were supposed to check the flop houses and stuff. The issue is, is I don't know if I should bring a Starian with me. Because he might just get it in his head to like try to kill these guys. And I don't want to have it. So, hang on. Oh my gosh. Asterian! Need something? Asterian! I would, but you have so many. Excellent. I'm nervous. That I've woman. Found so many victims for Cazador here. Uh huh. They're the kind of people no one would ever miss. Okay, let's let everything load. Let's let everything. I can't talk. Let's let everything load in. This is a nice place, honestly. Brr. Are we loading in? It is our chance to start. Ah. And I will gladly do so. They don't, they want to run? Is that, is that the impression I'm getting? They don't want to be with Cazador anymore? Makes a lot of sense. Also, I'm supposed to be looking for... I think the master plans to expand his territory. Take candle key. Maybe even... Flowers. Okay, oh, let's see. Siri, hi, I brought your brother. We should go. I do not want to face the master if we're late for his black mass. Soon, sister. I only need one more mark. Why are your eyes glowing? We have enough for the master. No more needed. It's not for the master, it's for me. I spent 100 years eating rats and dogs. But soon, I'll be able to feast. I want someone there, ready for me. And once the mass is done, and our Lord grants us freedom, oh. I can celebrate by drinking them dry. They think they're gonna survive. Casador promised you your freedom. Yeah. And you believed him. Ha! You were never burdened with intelligence, Petras. But your load seems especially light these days. Right. Okay, they're very A unhappy. <laughs> it, it cannot be. Oh, that's no way to welcome back a brother, doll. <laughs> Didn't you miss me? Why would you come back? You got out. You were free. Not my conversation. Isn't it obvious, sister? He wants to ascend with the rest of us. 
He heard about the ritual and the power our master will grant us. So he came back with his tail between his legs, hoping all would be forgiven. <sighs> you always were an idiot, Petras. Uh. Oh, the sunlight. Um, let's not. Where is he hiding? Tell me! Ah! Ah! Brother, please! Okay, now I should interfere. Asterian, stop. This is not, I don't, I, I get that he, he deserves justice, but like, he doesn't deserve to become the monster that Cazador is, you know, I think that would, if he did that, if he did what he wants to do, I think Cazador would actually just like die laughing and be like, oh yes, you've become the thing that you never wanted to be, which is me, you know, I don't know, maybe I'm reading too much into it, but I don't, I don't know. I'm surprised they're out and about, honestly. You owe your wretched life to my friend. Now tell me what I need to know. The Master is preparing the Black Mass. Beneath his palace, there's a defiled chapel. It was hidden there the entire time. Hidden from us all. Do you really think you can stop him? We did not. I'm the only one who can. We did not mention that. The sun can't harm me. Casador can't compel me. I don't need to fear him anymore. Also, their teeth are all pointy. Now like only go before I change my mind about roasting. Only his canines. Brother. This isn't over, Astarian. <laughs> Poor fools. They actually think Cazador will save them. Uh, warn him we're coming, yeah. Yes. And they'll be trembling in fear when they tell him. They're no threat to us. And they have no choice but to do Cazador's bidding. I pity them. See? This is why I didn't want him to kill them. All, they don't know their fate's already set. <laughs> they're doomed. The only question is whether yeah. their lives will be sacrificed to a monster like Cazador. Or serve a greater purpose. Seven sigils on seven spawn. And Cazador has the other six. We have to face him and take that power for ourselves. I mean, you want it for yourself. Yeah, for yourself. Are you ready to sacrifice them? Trust me, I'd rather slaughter someone else's family, but if that's what it I takes... I mean, I'm sure they couldn't necessarily and form it's not bonds. Like sweet innocence, they brought Cazador just as many victims as I did. Yeah. Huh. You're not getting sentimental, are you? I thought you were with me. I once. actually was blatantly not. I was blatantly not. And what if we're walking into a trap? Then we'll deal with it. It can't be worse than everything else we've faced. And now we know he's skulking beneath his palace. We can take the hunt to Kazador. I don't want to lose him. All right, let's go. This place stinks of rat blood and despair. I'm going to lose him, I think. Where's Minsk? Minsk is the other companion we're supposed to be getting at some point. Boo, 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 boo. Soap! No thievery. Oh. Double doors. Hmm. I did see a ladder. Not interested in stealing down people people's stuff who are down on their luck. I wonder if we'll have a choice 
for Asterion to save the children, and maybe they're actually, maybe they are alive because they're being saved for this ritual. Oh, that's probably what it is, because we were assuming they were dead. I was assuming they were dead, but they're probably being saved for the ritual. Um, so we might have a choice between, oh, either saving them or his siblings, or when the, when the sacrifice has to take place, not only would he have sacrifice his siblings, but he would have to sacrifice the children, too. I'm not going to let that happen. I know he might want that to happen, but there are some, and I, I try to not interfere too much in my friend's decisions concerning themselves, but, like, I'm always haunted by that one situation in Dragon Age 2 where I let Fenris kill his sister because I'm like, it's his life and his family, and, like, he suffered, and it's his decision, and then he was so miserable afterwards that he, when he did that, and my friend Lemonzy was like, and I'll just, I'll just, it's always with me, but Lemonzy was like, that's what friends are for. She, she was like, you monster, you know? Like, I can't believe you let him do that. Because, like, it's like, cause I was going, you know, on a whole kick about, like, you know, like, well, everyone's bodies is their own, and, like, their, their lives are their own, and they can make their own decisions, which is true and fair, but, like, anything taken to an extreme is bad. That's where you get, like, you know, like, fascist anarchy, which I don't think is actually, I think I just put those two words together and that's not actually a thing. But it's where you kind of get anarchy, where it's like every person for themselves, um, which is not necessarily what anarchy is, but that's kind of how it's interpreted. Um, and like, that's not good. That's not a good way to live, right? Uh, there's no rules, no laws, like people just doing what they want and hurting people when they want and facing no repercussions, you know? Um, so yeah, it's, uh, I felt really bad after that. So it's like, but, but the thing that really stuck with me too, especially was that like, it's like, that's what friends are for, is they're for offering a different perspective, right? It's for like, for like maybe saying, hey, I know you want to do this right now, but like, think about it for like two hours. And if you really, you know what I mean? Like, or think about it for a day or like, you know what I mean? Or just don't like, stop. You don't want to like, yes, whoever hurt you may deserve it, but like, you don't deserve to have that blood on your hands. You know what I mean? Um, so that was, that was my big thing is that, you know, I try to be like, you know, Hey, you do, you know, you do what you need to do, but it's also like, I need to interfere now, especially if it involves other people. And if a bunch of children are going to die, if Asterion doesn't stop himself from killing a bunch of children, I'm going to have to interfere, you know? So, oh, let's, let's see. see, let's see indeed. Yeah, a balcony. All right, so potentially whatever we're looking for is... How do I get out? Where's down? Okay, there we go. Um, Is in that locked room, which means my key might work on it. Um, But I would need... Don't touch me. Yeah, okay, hang on. Separate. Oak Father's blessing. Yeah, you become Kitty Cat. Kibby, Kibby Cat. Kitty! I haven't seen many kitty cats in town. And I will put Asterion over by the Step door. Lightly. If, if we don't need a lockpick, then I think he'll just take the key from me. Um, but I am gonna... Whatever shall it be? Meow, and then turn on... the timed mode. Come on, owl guy. Come on. Do we not have any lockpicks? Still alive. Did Gale so, have all progress. my lockpicks? Well, if it's not the flower one, then I don't really care. Uh, why did that guy go in there? Why did he... what? Wait, who just... So I need to unlock it and then find whatever is in there. Apparently, meow doesn't work on the dwarf, though. I am ready. That is news to me. Meow. 
There won't be another war. I we haven't done anything. All's well that ends. Well, meowing Not doesn't work on dwarves could have. apparently. She mind my step. What is she just doing on the stairs? I think I'll end this one here. I'm not actually sure if this is one episode or two. Hopefully two. I don't. But I'm, I'm gonna do a long rest, I think, because uh, I am running out of even with short rest. I'm running out of spells and stuff. Um, and really no harm in doing long rest just to see what people are up to. So. Yeah, anyway, thank you all for joining me. I appreciate it. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons. First, I want to give a shout out to my Acorn Tier patron. Thank you so much, Fame, for your support. I very much appreciate it. And I want to give an extra special shout out to my Sapling Tier patron, Riska Lido. Thank you so much for your support. I very much appreciate it as well. And I want to give an extra, extra special shout out to Christopher, my Forest Tier patron, who has truly gone above and beyond and has supported me in the channel. And I truly cannot thank you all enough. Um, so thank you all again. And I will see you in the next one.